Hi everyone, I'm Ryan Lund, and welcome to another episode of the Supper Club Social, where we review restaurants, movies, and TV shows, and talk about home bars, cocktails, and pop culture. With me today are three of the four horsemen of the apocalypse, death, famine, and conquest. How's it going today, guys? Not bad. Good. Wonderful. Well, on today's show, we're going to do a deep dive into the origins of the Israeli-Palestinian conflict. God. <laughs> and for the segment of the week, we have a 360 coverage of the upcoming election. Yeah, sounds like a fun time. <laughs> Just kidding, of course. Now, introducing the horseman. First up, he hasn't seen his chin in over 10 years. He's recently put a moratorium on buying new hats, and he's a hell of a bowler. It's Roy Smith, a.k.a. Conquest. Good to be back. Back home over here in the corner. <laughs> uh, next up, he was rec- he he recently was the president of the North American Scatological Society, Society until accusations of improper waste management less- led to his dismissal. He once spent a year under a vow of silence to better understand a whisper. He's a hog farmer and a hell of a good guy. It's Lyle, a.k.a. Famine. Oh, I was Fam- wondering. I was like, I know that could have gone either way. Yeah. Next up, he outkicks his coverage every single time. He's the fifth leaf on a f- fifth leaf on a four-leaf clover. He's known for his he is known for his urban kayaking skills, and he's a hell of a ventriloquist. It's Charlie, don't chuck my meat, chuck my nuts. McInerney, a.k.a. Death. Hello, hello. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> Quite the intro you two that got today. Yeah, yeah. Jeez. Last but Urban not canoe, least. Eh? <laughs> last but not least, his hair is receding faster than the shores of an incoming tsunami. He goes by the mantra, cleaning up the world one window at a time. And his favorite abbreviation is MBDFTG. He lived in a Volkswagen bus for a year, and he's a hell of a yard sailor. It's Ryan Kalund, a.k.a. War. <laughs> a.k.a. me. You didn't say what me and Lyle were. Yeah, I did. Your death. Lyle's death. No, no Chuck's I was, death. I was famine. Charlie. Oh, let me start over here. <laughs> Lyle's famine. Chuck or nuts is death. Roy, you are conquest. Mm. Let's see this hairline that you're talking about. Well, well, it's, it's creeping. It. Is it creeping? It's yeah. not as bad as mine. Mine's... Creep. Yeah. Let's see yours. Oh, I got it going both ends. <laughs> got it coming from the back and the front. Oh, I thought you were talking about downstairs. Oh, no. <laughs> got, like the devil's peak is what they call it. Oh, it's yeah. just deep in here. Oh, okay. Not, not nice. See, here. I've had these peaks since high school. They yeah. haven't changed. You peaked young, huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you want to peak early. Yeah. yeah. Not too early, though. All right. Well, Roy, any dust ups on the buffs, bus, beefs in the break room, unholy encounters, marketplace throwdowns, fantasy football faux pas, restaurant returns, or family man freakouts? I don't believe so, unfortunately. Wow. Oh, for five or six? I'm going to have yeah, one each you know, week I until had, I get something. I did waste about two hours a day driving to Halloween stores to not buy any Halloween costumes family from any store. Out. So, family yeah, man that was a out, good. Yeah. Good use of my time today. Mm-hmm. So okay. I guess that's a not so much a freak out, but a little bit of disappointment. At whom or who? Just the fact that we drove to like six different stores and didn't were buy. Were scouting out to see what was out there? Or? No, we were went to go buy. Okay. And then like the actual Halloween stores, it would have been like 200 bucks, mm. like out yeah. the door. And I'm like, no, no way in hell. Go to Walmart, like five costumes to choose from. Kids didn't want them. Dang go to Fred Meyer, they had like two costumes. Not what anyone wanted. Jeez. And then Target had nothing. And so it's like, fuck. This wow. Is, went to Amazon. Got a nice little tour of the north side, though. Yeah, sure did. Don't go to Fred Meyer very often. Yeah. No, boy, I haven't been. It's been years since I've been in a Fred Meyer. So you just go to Value Village Ooh. and like just try to throw it together. Oh, I know. Well, we yeah. thought that's what one of the kids was going to do, and then they last second changed their mind. Huh. Not bad, not bad. Mm. But they're ordered now on Amazon. They should be here this week. Good old Could've Amazon. done that from the seat of my couch, though. Yeah. Yeah. Alrighty. Well, uh, Lyle, last good show you've watched. What book are you reading? And what's the last thing you cooked that nobody would eat? <laughs> well, I'm I'm an amazing cook, so I can't remember my last epic failure. Okay. Um, but we've got a routine, so it's pretty simple. Sure. <laughs> I mean, you're playing like, the hits. Yeah, you're playing the, especially with all the kids. It's like spaghetti, egg drop soup. Gotcha. Dumplings. Yeah. Easy stuff. What was the other question? Book. What, what oh, book are you reading right now? Book. Um, it's a good one. It is The Mercy of Gods by James S. <laughs> a. Corey. What's that about? It's sci-fi nerd stuff. <laughs> Speaking of that, I turned my dad on to The Expanse. 
I bet he loves it. Um, I would think so. I haven't asked oh, him again. I just know that he was going to try it. He texted so. me this week. I'll have to You'll touch have to base on that. How yeah. the ships flip around to slow down. Yeah, gravity. Yeah. yeah, that's awesome. It's good stuff. Mm. Good deal. Um, Alrighty. Um, How about you? What have you been up to? Well, just hold your horses. Hold, 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 I jumped ahead. Charlie, what's the best beer you've had lately? Not from Linda's. What's your favorite fall type activity? And what's the most requ- requested food item that you cook? I'd say the best beer was uh, we were at Vantage Point mm. last weekend. Yeah, and they had their hazy. Uh, I can't remember the name of it is, but no, their hazy was delicious. It looked super thick, like she dropped it at the table. I'm like, oh god, yeah, it's like, like straight orange like juice, just yeah, and but it drank really, really light, nice. which surprised me because normally those it's like a full meal. Was it like a, a higher percent? Uh, mm. no, it was like six, six, one, I think mm. six, two, nothing yeah. crazy, but yeah. it was, I wish I would have taken a picture of it, but <laughs> no, it was really good. Is it dark? Like, um, like milkshake look cream. Yes. Looking? Okay. Yeah. yeah. And I've had those before where it, it's like a 20 minute beer. And when you're done, it's just <laughs> a gut bomb. Yeah. But this yeah. one was not, I had two of them in and I felt great. Nice. Yeah. They've got a lot of good beers out there. They I don't do. think, yeah. um, and good food. Yeah. I have never been disappointed there. No. no. Then I got the smash burger there this summer. Yeah, that's a good one. And I'm just not a smash burger guy. No. Like, I just don't need to mess. It seemed, I don't know. I'm just not weird. it right. Yeah. I was in a weird mood that day. I got asked like four times if I was from Idaho or not. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, guys, like, I'm paying to be here, okay? <laughs> just leave me alone. <laughs> like, I work here, okay? <laughs> God. That was ridiculous. Uh, I remember the the food request. What was the second part of the question? Yeah. um, Food. Oh, favorite beer. Fall. uh, What's your favorite fall type activity? Oh, man. I'm not. uh, I really don't. Honestly, it's college football season. So for me, it's just, yeah, watching watching college football. Well, that's. It's not really like an activity, but. uh, Well, it takes time out of your day. It We're does. getting into that those years where watching watching something is an activity. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, food request with Audrey, my daughter. It's I make a chicken orzo lemon chicken orzo soup mm. that she wants me to make all the time. Mm. Uh, Graham's like me; he wants steak. And Megan, she's just she's very easy, just like whatever. Nice orzo uh, is a type of pasta. Type of pasta right? like looks large like rice. Yeah. yeah. The, so is it a ball shape? No, it looks no, like a piece of rice. It looks, it looks like a piece of okay. rice, but larger. What's yeah. that round one? Pasta? Pastini? I don't know. Come on, gnocchi? Pet, de pet, um, couscous? Couscous, oh, Well, yeah. that's a... That's not really... Yeah, that's not I know pasta. what you're talking about, yeah. though, but... Yeah, yeah. orzo's really good. Yeah, orzo's yeah. It's like awesome. a, new, a rice noodle, pretty much. I think much. I've had that a lot in, like, cold... Uh, Salads, I guess, yeah. or, um, and they put like them in like chicken noodle easy. soup sometimes. Yeah, like, mm. they'll put it in that instead. Yeah, it's like a super easy soup noodles. to make. Nice. Well, you guys, we've got a full show today. We've got what have you been up to? Wonderful. Yeah, any Tell uh, us about you. DIY, <laughs> not so DIY faux pas, or uh, <laughs> yeah, sure, well, little home maintenance. We've had an interesting run of uh, things lately. We had a uh, our sewer backed up. Mm-hmm. And when they were trying to fix the sewer, they cracked another pipe. So I kind of was like kicking the tires and trying to do all that myself and fix it. So I was in the crawl space digging down. Not pleasant, but informative. Ended up paying to get that fixed. They ended up fixing the sewer. But oh, they did. Did you have to get the main line from like the house to the yeah. street you place? So yeah. Yeah, every about. So we have this uh, little junction where the new additions come in and the pipe come. The, drain to the sewer line comes down at this angle and the cleanouts this way and the blockage is like right here yeah so they hit that and go up this other pipe and it was this one section of pipe that's at orangeburg yep um it's only like three feet long that's yeah. what broke but um uh yeah so we actually had one one rotator guy show up and he's like yeah i think it's fixed and i knew just by what he said that because i wasn't yeah. here that he didn't that he went up and didn't go out which is so obvious. It's 11 feet yeah. from the thing. Like, how could you say it's clear? You didn't mm-hmm. even do anything. So that was 180 bucks out the window. Um, then Bulldog Rooter came, which we'd had them out before, but it was like six or $700, and it was a chore. But they got it done. So and then fixing the pipe was like 400 bucks or something. But, um, yeah, so that. And then we had a little roof leak <laughs> <laughs> the night after that. 
Um, so we had been our sewer clock on a Saturday. The roof leaked on Tuesday. Uh, I don't know Wednesday or something like that. And we've had a spot that's been kind of tricky. If the piles up with debris, it causes a little backup. So I cleaned that out and I filled all in little all the crevices with some sealant, roofing tar type stuff. So I think that'll help. It's been on the list for a long time, so finally just did it. But and yeah, that's about it. Anything else happened to me, Roy? Mm. My check engine light came on again. <laughs> <laughs> God, you writing a country song? Beep, beep. I know that one. I bought one of those reader things, and it's just the. Uh, Is it the fix it or? I don't know. Remember that one on TV they're advertising all the time? No, I went to a hardware or a automotive store, Roy mm. O'Reilly's. Oh, oh, oh O'Reilly's, oh, oh. and uh, got the middle grade one. Nice. So if you ever want some information, it's a really confusing thing to use. Yeah, because it, it gives you a code, <laughs> and you look the code up, right? Yeah, it, it reads the code, but it has all this other functionality that you're just like you're looking at like what runs a Starship, basically. Yeah, it's really confusing, but. You know, every time I thought about taking it in, the check engine light's not on. Yeah, that's how it always goes. Um, so this way I have the code saved and they can read that data yeah. rather than having to Especially if you go to a real shady uh, mechanic. <laughs> yeah. Nobody seems to get good business by it but you. Is oh, it yeah. one towards Indian Trail? Well, you know, it's out, out in that area. Yeah. <laughs> by a grocery store, I think. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, mine's by a brewery. <laughs> <laughs> so, must be a different place. Yeah. Must be. Uh, so yeah, that's all I've been dealing with. I haven't slept a lot, and I've been super busy at work, so it's been a little bit of a nightmare, but we're on the other side of it all. Nice. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, so um, uh, segment of the week this week, we are diving into Wiles Trivia Trainwreck. Oh yeah, it's that's a <laughs> classic <laughs> callback. What could go wrong? Now, did you write an orange pen again? Oh my god. No, it's orange pen on yellow paper. Oh, yeah, it was a disaster. And he was sitting right under the little window oh. light that's off, but he couldn't see anything, and he's making all this shit up. You could tell he had no idea what was going on. It was oh, hilarious. It was being finicky again. All right, we'll work on it in the break. But yeah, and then he reread the same question like three times. <laughs> he couldn't tell if he got the points because he couldn't. <laughs> he would be like this. Like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you should have been here. Yep. Uh, a little was, better set. I think I remember watching that episode. Oh, trying yeah. to. It was like, oh, what is so happening? bad? Um, but yeah. I think we took like a break, and he's like, oh, next question. Yeah, and like, you read you the asked exact that question <laughs> two questions ago. <laughs> That's right. Well, because I went out of order, and I couldn't see my check marks yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then roy would kind of look over and go yeah that's the wrong point you put that on the wrong person and then yeah. they'd kind of start talking and he'd forget where he's at and then you deduct points just randomly no <laughs> yeah. i don't like that you're lose yeah. five points that might have been towards the end of a double episode yeah was, uh, it could have been those days he was worked up all right well let's put a pin in this we will come back for the happy hour well happy hour first and then we'll probably start some trivia all nice. right sounds all good right. all right good deal oh wait i forgot to push the button so if you just hang out and talk for just a second, all right, good be here. Yeah. And um, Chuck is back. Good yeah, yeah. Yes, I'm, I'm back. I'm Chuck here. Long Chuck hiatus with the sweet with stash. The stash. Yeah. It's the season. Yep, it's the season. Duster. You want to smell it? <laughs> <laughs> I do, but let's do it on Let's camera. do it break. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we'll all take a turn. We'll get in line. <laughs> all right, we'll be right back. Cheers. It's happy hour. Welcome back to the show, everybody. <laughs> Time for happy hour. Oh man! Um, yeah. Happy times, hour. Every times. episode of Happy Hour, we like to start off with a quote. Um, uh, it is the wine that leads me on, the wild wine that sets the wisest man to sing at the top of his lungs. Laugh like a fool, it drives the man to dance. It even tempts him to blurt out stories better not told. Mm. That's from Homer. Wow. I like Homer it. Homer Simpson? Homer Simpson? No. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> no, not Homer Simpson. You'd be a lot cooler if it was. <laughs> yeah, it would be. Uh, I could see them dropping that in the middle of an episode. just Via timeout.com. Mm. Uh, today, the cocktail is the Martinez. Oh, yeah. Now, the Martinez is a predecessor to the Manhattan, they say. There's a lot of different variations on the exact recipe, so we just went by the one in the bible here Mm -hmm. can't be wrong and let's see here no substitutions so this is actually straight up a real recipe roy is going to tell us a little bit about it 
Oh, wow, this is a lot. It's my favorite part of every podcast. Here we go. The Martinez is a cocktail that any classic drink connoisseur will definitely want to note. It may even become your new favorite. This one Ooh. of the predecessor to the classic gin martini. It is very similar, though. A, it's very similar, though. A just a little bit different. Did you type this up yourself? Nope. Copied and pasted. <laughs> well, there's some errors in it. From the spruceseats.com. Uh, so it can easily shake up any cocktail routine and may find yourself in. Uh, in the oh, Martinez, wow. a hint of sweetness is added to the gin and vermouth combination. It opts for sweet vermouth over dry and brings in just a hint of maraschino liqueur. The result is a smooth and uplifting drink that is perfect at any time of day, See even it. early in the morning. I'm seeing a lot of smiling faces here, Roy. Yep. The Martinez is a perfect cocktail when made properly. The spice notes of the gin dance on the sweet vermouth, <laughs> while the maraschino pops an upbeat to every sip. It is so memorable that even when you have a bad one, and you will, <laughs> you will want to try a Martinez again. Sean Johnson. Well, thank you, Sean Johnson, from the Spruce Eats. Yeah, let me get a little taste yeah. of this bad boy here. Specifically, we had two ounces mm -hmm. of Old Tom Gin, half ounce of Sweet Vermouth, the Coqui de Torino, and a bar spoon of maraschino liqueur. It called for a quarter mm. ounce, but this really only... Maraschino liqueur. That is a good one. Always yeah. cut it in half, whatever the recipe says. That's delicious. Tell you about the mustache. You get a little extra then, flavor. Yep. We yeah. did a dash a of flavor orange saver. bitters and a dash of that's, aromatic bitters. That'd be trouble. That's a... With, garnished with lemon peel. Yeah, that's, that's good. That's good. That's really that's good. good. That's really good. I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. No, that's must yeah. have had me about mm. fifteen, Doctor. <laughs> you almost made me just blow out <laughs> my whole thing. Almost had a blowout, eh? Um, tasty drink. Yeah, that is. We've had this one before a while ago, though. We have. I think. Um, do we do this one to the Godfather? That would have been a bad choice if we did. <laughs> it's a lot of booze. It's coming back to me. <laughs> uh, the Godfather have. was the second episode of that day, so maybe. Yeah. Very possible. No, it's a good one. I remember liking it the first time we had it. Yeah. The first time we had it was from an old episode. Well, the recommendation came from it when we had Kirby Kirby Jean Creative. I don't know, remember her handle. Mm -hmm. She's kind of moved away from the cocktails that she moved photographed and stuff. Onto food. Food lately. and... Um, Desserts. Yeah. But she suggested this, and um, boy. Boy, it's a good one. one. Yeah, yeah, it is yeah. good. Delicious. Fantastic. And Could my least favorite glass, though. Yeah, Roy's not a Coop fan. I'm you guys a have a real... Coop. But, it's, you know, you do get more of the... I know, but it's just... You get the smell. It's, it's the floral. Yeah, yeah, it's the... Yep. The nose. Mm -hmm. Does the stem scare you, Roy? No, I just feel like it's just... Get that pinky out. Mm. Does it remind you of grabbing your own penis? <laughs> <laughs> uh, a, little, a little bit bigger. Oh, sure. a, little, a little bigger. Sure, yeah. Well, and it gets thicker at the end rather than yeah. narrow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We call it I don't know. The, I just the Great don't. Pyramid. <laughs> it's just I, just, I feel like it's always going to spill. <laughs> sure. Um, <laughs> all right. Well, mm -mm. Uh, so yeah, uh, for the rest of Happy Hour, I just kind of want to chat a little bit. I want to set up our trivia game. Well, we've had a couple of train wrecks with trivia, so I want to iron out all <laughs> these details beforehand. What could go wrong? Um, Lyle, I'm thinking, I'm thinking you can sit on the other side of Roya. Okay. Um, on the other side of the bar. So oh, like a game reading, host. Yeah, I, I like if that. you're comfortable with that. Yeah, absolutely. And we're thinking one point for right answer. And this like is up for debate. Oh, um, oh, oh, if somebody oh. answers... I don't think we have very good listening ears. Right we now. don't. They're I'm listening. Really? I'm listening football. and looking. Yeah. Um, so if somebody answers a question wrong, and then somebody answers it after that, do you guys consider that a steal? And should they get a full point or a half point for a steal? I'm probably a full point. Full, full yeah, point. I vote full point. Okay. And you're talking it because it's a, a, you got to ring in to answer, right? So we're instead of bringing the lights out. Remember, it was a yeah. lot of pounding on the bar, and it came into the mics. So we're just gonna do like okay. And while it's gonna be up to the big guy to call it mm. out. Yeah. Let's see some favoritism happening here. Um, mm. I'd like to ask: Are we allowed to answer before the question is fully read? You can, but then the then I stop reading. Right. So. Yeah. It's okay. a risk you got to take yourself. So okay. what about this? Yeah. If you answer it wrong, is it a negative point? I think you just don't get a point. Yeah, you just don't. Yeah. It's not a negative point. A negative yeah. point would be like uh, something uncouth being done. Yeah. 
taunting, you know, something like that. Unsportsmanlike like conduct. So it's up to me if I, I could penalize you for, yeah. like, talking shit. Uh, yeah. Are we yeah. going yeah, to okay. allow Lyle some points to, you know, maybe credits for gamemanship or I, I, respectfulness? I think so. I think so, if I'm reading it. I don't know. If you take shirt off and, oh, hey, well, yeah, man. if you give a little show, maybe I, a little I, something extra. I don't want to suggest anything, hey, but. What happens yeah. behind the bar? He does take bribes, I hear. <laughs> <laughs> goes, I don't know why Especially. he goes to the bathroom 15 <laughs> times an episode. Yeah. <laughs> Crazy. Crazy. All right. Well, um, let's uh, take a quick break. We're going to resituate and we're going to launch into some trivia. All right. Sounds good. Can hardly wait. I meant to unpause this right away. I never do. It's not even working. Oh. Oh, you turned the sound way down. Just do a quick reset. Yeah. We're going to pound these quick reset down and get another one. That's the way to go, Roy. I'm going to put some pinups over in the bathroom area. So totally. Here we got something to look at. <laughs> so if my dad ever goes missing, we'll yeah. know where he's at. <laughs> Jumping balls! Look at it! It's time to dive into the segment of the week. All right, everybody. Welcome back to the show. <clears throat> it is the segment of the week. It is trivia's, uh, Lyle's trivia train wreck. <laughs> And it's another round of Martinez. Oh, yeah. Ooh, boy. They're going down easy. Mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. I want to say we did the last one on a, off a double episode, sure. which can get... That was an outlier. ...down the rabbit hole a little on, bit. on track Yeah, this we're, we're pretty solid right now. And you used a uh, dark-colored pen. That's good. Yeah. I don't like this angle. <laughs> you don't like the angle on my dangle? <laughs> All right. Well, All right. So, well, have at it. Um, we've discussed the rules. We're ready to rock. And it's a raise your hand thing, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. I'd like a snap. Oh. Snap. Well, who do you, know, you know who snaps? But like yeah. visual snap. So I get like... Yeah. Like is that a visual? So so visual I, and audio. What is a visual but what if like, I like, them up this snap. way, but my snap isn't there? Huh? What if you snap on the way up? At our age, Chuck, we should be able to Let's do both. Let's do the first I, question I and yeah. see how it goes. Okay. Yeah. A little test run Wasting a lot of time here. Okay. Little, well, wasting well, time. Or are we using it? Time. Well, it's never wasted if you're wasted all the time. That's true. That was my MySpace quote. <laughs> <laughs> we should have moved the camera over here. Well, too late, late for that looking now. at all of us, you know? That's right. It's all right, here we go. You guys ready? Yep, yep ready. Ready to rock. Where is the Mona Lisa? The Louvre. Bing, bing. Isn't it Louvre? No, no it's, it's the Louvre. Louvre. Nice try. Yeah. That might be... I'm going to deduct you a half point for that. <laughs> <laughs> this stuff Minus is already one. sounding very familiar. Mm-hmm. Minus one half. <laughs> You're Minus not going to be able to add all this up. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> you never Lowe can. has one He's not a math point. teacher, Ryan. <laughs> all right. That was great. All right. Oh, I'm surprised I got that. Last time we made the mistake of giving him sound effects, I yeah. believe. Yeah, I that was so. fantastic. I'm we also might have to bring that planning back. on typing up all these uh, trivia questions and putting them on Facebook for people to... Ooh, that's like getting that. us a lot of good engagement with yeah. like what we do on the show. Put it out there. We had the last episode's over 100 views, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Okay. Ready, gentlemen? Yeah. Question yep. two. Dun, dun, dun. And I would like to answer you guys to <laughs> answer this in the form of a question like Jeopardy. Okay. <laughs> so you should have said... Oh come on! The, the, no, in the uh, Louvre, you're, you're, you no. give him just it's too much. A, yeah. a slight he's, amount he's of power. He's got a real power trip. Yeah. All right, here we go. Who is the first? Who is the current first lady of the United States? <laughs> it's Kamala Harris. No. Who is the current Doctor Biden? No, it's Kamala Harris. Isn't first it? lady, Hillary Clinton. First oh, the lady. first lady. Fuck. I'm going to subtract a half point Didn't for that. You mean that, vice Chuck. president? <laughs> Who is the current it's first lady? Jill. Doctor Jill. Jill. Doctor Jill Biden. Jill Biden. But I had Doctor Biden. I was the what, closest I just, one. I. I'm going to give you both a half point for that. For what? I said doctor. I heard she is the a doctor. Totally wrong. She is a doctor. I heard and that's all I hear. It's Doctor Biden. I used to the first lady, Doctor. Johnny, okay. <laughs> yeah, doesn't so you fit there. Okay. okay. I'm back You're even still heard the, who is the first even, first lady? Oh, I lady. Uh, like, I think I said who is the current first lady. I thought it was I vice president the, yeah. for some reason. I know. I, heard I the couldn't understand wrong. why you guys were looking at me. I'm like, <laughs> yeah. what do you mean? That's right. <laughs> I can't remember her first name, but I know she was a doctor. No, and I had to think about that. It was like, oh, what's her name? I don't know <laughs> how I knew that at yeah. all. All mm-hmm. right, here we go. Okay. What? Do you call a baby goat? 
Mm. What do you call a baby goat? A baby goat. <laughs> is a sheep the same thing as a goat? No. No, that's a sheep, not a goat. I'm just going to go on a limb here. There we go. Uh, I lost it. I'm going to say... <laughs> I can't remember. Never mind. Never mind. A calf. No. That's what I was thinking, but I lost it. A cow. Does he want the L pronounced? I don't know. A baby goat. A jack. A jack. Oh, is it? It's a kid. There are some Oh, kid. A kid. kid. I knew that. I'll take half a point for knowing it. Because I remember. (laughs) (laughs) All right. Here we go. We're rolling here. Mm -hmm. What is the... You guys ready? Yeah. Yeah. Do you guys know what a surname is? Yes. Yeah. That is your last name. Yep. Okay. Thank you. What is the most common surname in the United States? I'm going to give it to Chuck. Smith. Bing, bing. Mm, oh, nice. It's still only one point. You got two bings, though. So now you're a positive half point, Chuck. <laughs> You got a negative? He did get a negative. Yeah, for his attitude. (laughs) What'd you do? (laughs) He said Kamala. No, I said Clinton. (laughs) Oh, yeah, Hillary Clinton. That's right. You said Kamala. (laughs) There we go. I forgot how much uh, trivia proved how dumb we are last time we played. (laughs) 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 I remember my mom talked to me after the episode. She just was like, (laughs) (laughs) But they're not in the moment. It's tough. It's a lot of pressure. pressure. It's like those game drinking. Yeah. Yeah. Marsha. Hi, Marsha. We all love you. Except for who did that. <laughs> Our next Martinez, we're going to have to try with a different gin because we've almost polished off that bottle. <laughs> All right, you guys ready? Right, yep. We got one more left in there. We never read from this. Was Oops. Alexander Hamilton Alexander ever a president? Hamilton. Oh. Just, I was here. Yeah, a but little I was, bit. A little bit. Right. No. I was fully erect, though. You were half staff. Correct. <laughs> what? Oh, you were going to say yes? Negative. <laughs> he was going to answer in the Never was a president. I didn't say he was. I you was th- you were wanting you to. Yeah, because you were half. I was full. All right. Is that. Here we go. <laughs> what two... Okay, do we know what primary colors are? Yes. Yeah. Cup. What two primary colors can be mixed to make purple? Hmm. Rye. I mean, I freeze my hand five minutes ago. Yeah. Um, that would be red and blue. Yeah. Nice. Very good. Took art in my one year of. Uh, no, actually, college. that was in high school. I did. <laughs> was home ec. Yeah. I took four years of home ec in high school. I mm. wish they still did it. I did. I know they um, should. You got a f- you got a second for a funny art class story. Yeah. So you know we did our work. You're drawing the model or whatever, and then you had to like. She would call up like five students to put their pictures up, and she would like go, "Oh, I like your use of light there," and blah blah blah. And I was horrible at art, just awful. <clears throat> and I only took it because Eric Jensen was in the class, mm. and he's like, "Man, just put yours upside down, <laughs> see if she notices." And it was like a vase and like something that's obviously you can see. The, yeah, that's not so right. I put it upside down. She's doing everybody's. She gets to mine. She goes, "Hmm." And she just couldn't find any word. <laughs> and I go, oh, just a second. <laughs> I'll be darned. <laughs> and she just laughed because she, like, we had this understanding that, like, I was trying. Type of thing. Yeah, you're trying to screw around. Yeah. No, I was trying to do the work. No, yeah. you gave a good effort. <laughs> I did a lot of art. Uh oh, he's slipping a page. I do. The, Actually, some I of those were tough. Took and my turn. Lost just page. my thumb and art. Yeah. <sighs> just warming you guys. Call up. me Van Gogh. All right, you guys ready? <laughs> yeah. What and is the world's largest retailer? Chuck or nuts? Walmart. Ding ding, mm. Chuck. Chuck's on the board. Mm. Back to a half. Nope, you're right. Who knows that? Point point? Half. with the Walmart error. All right. He's riding too big on the score. He's going to run out of space. He is going to run out of space. In what year did World War II end? Lloyd. 46. Nope. Yeah, Shock. his hand up first. Yeah. World War 43. No. No, it started in 44. Uh, so That's our engagement. 
I think. Mm-hmm. When the, what are we thing. considering the end of the war? V Day. Uh, Victory yeah. in Japan. Yeah. What year? That's not the traditional V Day. Um, <laughs> He's a teacher. I'm okay. just gonna go something a little outside the envelope and go forty nine. It was no. 1945. <sighs> I feel like it was mm-hmm. longer than that. Mm-hmm. I said 46, mm-hmm. right? Yes. You said 47. All right, a hard. booze <clears throat> question. You guys ready? Yeah. Yep. All right, booze. Going to booze. <laughs> yes, He's please. <laughs> Charlie's just like, <laughs> yes, please. <laughs> I got it. What is the difference between brandy and cognac? Mm. Mm. Brassel. Uh cognac is from <laughs> grapes. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna ask this again. Think about the difference between whiskey Scotch and is it rye or uh, I am getting that <laughs> Tennessee whiskey, what do they call that? Bourbon. That, so bourbon and whiskey. Think about that difference. That'll help you on this. That's the difference between oh, brandy, brandy and cognac. Is aged in oak barrels. So cognac is the same as brandy. Wine but barrels. But cognac must come from the cognac region in France. Mm, like champagne. Mm-hmm. It is from grapes, though. <laughs> that's not the no. answer you're looking for, sir. Yeah, it is. Is Good. it? Way to be brave, Brandy? Though. Yeah. That's what we gave to Kristen of the Garland Sandwich Shop. Because uh, she couldn't have any barley... Anything like that. Okay. Whiskey and stuff. So we did a vodka drink. Yeah, we did. <laughs> <laughs> Liar. <laughs> you said I'm throwing was, lies. I remember talking about... It was vodka. Mm-hmm. Potatoes or anything. Yep. Could you make vodka out of carrots? There was a splash. I think you could. You try. There. You can milk anything. <laughs> <laughs> I've got, got strong it. hands. Yeah. Well, All right. Here we go. Let's keep this moving. Loose, fast grip. That's right. Loose. Yeah. We Loose and learn fast. That. We're running into that part of the yeah, where you, alcohol where you, where you don't find the hot spots. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you don't want a hot spot. All right. Where does a dog sweat from? He beats you. His mouth. Nope. There's paws. Ding, ding, wow. Chuck. Learn something That's... every day. That's why they freeze to the ground in the oh, the winter time. <laughs> <laughs> That's why they got those little mittens. Take it. All right, we're gonna get a little tougher one here. I'm falling behind. You guys ready? Yep. By what nickname is the Wild West character William Bonney known for? It's Roy. I'm about to okay. say you, <laughs> Wild Bill. No. Hitchcock. Huckleberry. No. That's Doc Holliday. What was the question again? <laughs> yeah. Good. Yes. Can you we, ask we didn't, can we, a, Yeah, we haven't established this, but I, a I will accept it. Wow. It's been a while. I will accept it. By what what nickname is the Wild West character William Bonnie known? The Red Ranger. I might subtract a half point for all of you. <laughs> is it Billy the Kid? Yeah. <laughs> That's the William got me. Yeah. I was all thinking... Right. Uh, Wild Bill. He's more popular. Here we go. Hold on. Smoke pot with old Willy Billy. (laughs) (laughs) You guys ready? Yeah. In what? In which country? Hold on. In which country was Elon Musk born? Chuck beat you. (laughs) Holding him down. (laughs) North Africa. Nope. Is there a or north? South, is or, there uh, a north? No, sh- I, is there no, a North Africa? No, I don't. I That's don't. a half point. <laughs> that <laughs> is a half point. Did he mean truck. Northern no, Africa? I, He's yeah. white, you know. Yeah, know. that's a half. That's I, a halfer. I, I got mixed up. Yeah. So Kamala you, Harris. <laughs> you're back to one for that. I'll tr- Sorry, I'll, I'll try. Yeah, I know you're try. Is it South Africa? Can you do a South African accent? I'm not sure what that is. It's real neat. Is it kind of British It stutter a lot. Yeah, it's. They seem like they always stutter when they try to. It's weird. I'm not familiar with that one. It's weird. Um, The guy from. Just uh, watch Invictus. Yeah. Yes. Mm. Good movie. All right. Well, well, do I get a point for that? I did that on purpose. 
Just to fuck up Lyle. <laughs> <laughs> Could we get a scoring update? Um, Look at all that shit next to this. Is a fun <laughs> what the fuck is that? He goes, Highly Griffix. Um. <laughs> Roy has one and a half. No, I don't. Yeah, I've got. How did I have one and a half when I had one and a half already? Well, one and a half. Didn't we? Next but then time, I got one. The so last you're at time two and a half. we did this, didn't we establish that he would ask the questions and you would keep score? Oh, yes. Yeah. I, I'm pretty sure we did. It, that's moving all forward, we need, to, we need to do that. <laughs> so you need let's to just make sure you right circle a one with and then a two, then a one and a half, then a half, then a one. You got a couple minuses, though. Yeah, and that so, took you down to one. So you got so you're two back and a half, one and a half two. Two. <laughs> Ryan's at two. So I'm in the lead currently. He yeah, gets, it, it's a close race. I'm not sure you did your math right. Yeah, I, I'm not sure. I, that's, that's a lot of math. So what it's is like it? One and a half. <laughs> so you should have. I think Chuck has. So why don't we? Why don't I'm we just, pass the? I'm trying to get powers. negative points because I'm going to answer questions weird. <laughs> okay. just to fuck with them. Let's pass we got the three scoring minutes. powers. Only over hurt to, yourself. Hey, I don't. I'm, what's the final prize? <laughs> thumbs <Nothing>. up. Yep. <laughs> King of all respect. Trivia. Respect. Uh, Chuck got a lot of respect. respect. So Three should minutes. we just switch the scoring process over to Roy right now? Yeah, that works. Sure. All right. I need the pen. <laughs> you guys ready? Yep. What does the car company BMW stand oh, for? I think he asked this. I, I was a repeat. Oh. BMW. British Motor. Nope. Nope. Think. Think. Think like this. Yeah. Ryan. I like to be called. Ryan. B- Bavarian Motor Works. Bavarian Motor Works, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. We drive fast in our We cars. do. Oh. They're so good. Wow, we put the trunk in the front. Oh, said Bavarian Motors worldwide. <laughs> worldwide, yeah. <laughs> Prestige. Worldwide. All right, here we go. <laughs> said that exactly the same time. Which <laughs> Olympic sport is played with brooms? And stones. Oh, curling. Nice. Yeah, buddy. Sweeping. Good one. All right. How are we doing on time? <laughs> we got okay. A minute forty-five. What is acrophobia? A fear of acrophobia. Think of the Latin root. Phobia. Acrobatics. No. Spinning, jumping, twirling. No. Shh! Don't get deductions. Gymnasts. Don't get deductions. Shh. Acrophobia. Acra. Is it spiders? That's no. an acrophobia. That's an acrophobia. No, it's not. Spiders? No. <laughs> it's close, though. Fear of height. Oh, really? Oh. Okay. Did he just lisp when he said I did that? lisp a little bit. Mm. <laughs> so, it's the fear of height, guys. <laughs> okay. One minute. Well, let's One put minute. a let's pin, put a pin in, in this thing. We'll... Turn on a little music, and we're going to move it on to the next segment, right. guys. Nice. Right? Lyle, you're doing great. Yeah. Yeah. Are you feeling good about this? That, that Better than last that time, went well. for the scoring. Boy, he loves taking away points. Oh, yeah. I do. <laughs> Jerk. <laughs> <laughs> I think he's got something against you, Chuck. Yeah. He's a mustache. Dude. North Africa? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, where's okay. North Africa? <laughs> I'll show you on the map. <laughs> you know, he could have just I've said I've got an African wrong. question. Instead, he shamed you. I did shame you, and I apologize for that. It's all right. It's fine. I did it. Welcome back to the show, everybody. We have a vicious game of Lyle's trivia train wreck going on. Now, not a train wreck yet. Not yet. Well, <laughs> we had to pass off your scoring. It's not a double episode. People in the back of the train don't know it's a wreck until the very end. That's true. Well, that's a good one. Um. Yeah. Roy, we have a new scorekeeper. Yep. Can we get a scoring update? <laughs> so, we have Rye Dog at three, Chuck at one and a half somehow. I'm going to redo that math here in a little bit. <laughs> and I am currently in the lead with three and a half. Oh, that's because I got a really shitty you negative at the beginning I for know. nothing. Well, I know. We're well, checking attitude. that. Attitude. What did I do? You even remember. Say it. What did I do? It's okay. Just your tone oh, yeah, in like general. Tone. <laughs> huh? Do you want another half point? <laughs> You're not the scorekeeper anymore. Right. Oh. Let's keep this train of moving. <laughs> All right. You're going to have to tell Roy to subtract the bend. A point. All right. It's going to get a little tougher now. I've okay. saved these ones. I've kind of been cherry picking. I do have a question here. What happens if you tell Roy to lose a half a point on himself and he doesn't do it? You actually, Chuck actually has two points. Oh, good job, Charlie. I just huh? redid Lyle's math here. 
He's got two points. Okay. All right, let's just move it on here. Let's well, go. Well, and we'll have one if... Yeah, okay, here we go. <laughs> I, I don't know where I was going with that thought. I can only imagine. That's so rare for you. I know. How many months of the year have 31 days? And there's a little... Five. Eh. Reasonably guessed. Think about it. Four. Eh. It's only Seven. <laughs> Is it really? Double points. Wow. Because he double points. Double points. Is it really seven? You, yep. Because we ruled out. Many. Because yeah. We ruled out so six Chuck, of the numbers. Chuck has taken the lead. Don't overthink it. That's with four. Math. I didn't think it was that many. Right, isn't it? Well, it's December, there's, there's like, January, a, February, there's like February, a little April, trick May, to it. June, July. I didn't source check is any of knuckles? this information. Is it the, the knuckles or the gaps? <laughs> when you're like this, it's like it's like that, and then and that's how you get a blister. That, yep, that's that how you get the hot spot. Hot spot. <laughs> that's <laughs> what the hot spot. You can't counts. turn it like that, Lyle. Is that where the hot spot turns it's, in? It's up and down. Could be. You can't be doing a right hook on the thing. <laughs> No wonder where you're getting a hot spot. You can't, you can't be putting a bend in it. Boom. It's <laughs> his pole. Oh, yeah. good gravy. Yeah. Uh, he needs some gravy, apparently. A lot of it. Yeah. All right, here we go. Never touch any of the walls that are on the right <laughs> side of the wall. Don't turn on a black light in his yeah. house. We've got a close game here. Okay, yeah. here we go. We sure do. <laughs> <laughs> so think of a, a die. That you roll. This isn't okay. a dice. Question. A dice. Well, it'd be a well, die. Well, yeah, a die for singular. singular. Yeah, okay. Touche. Okay. How many dots are in a six sided die? Mm. Right dog. Right dog. Five. 21. What's that? 21. Well done. Yeah. Well, well done, you Pig. You did the, uh, I liked your strategy there. Okay. I didn't have a strategy. I you just did. The question. I you used did? to do that because I used to do that yardsy thing. Oh yeah. So I used to do all those. Yeah. How many are on two? Forty-two. <laughs> Give it to me. No. Nah. No. Give it to me, Roy. Give me uh, a half. No. No. Nope, nope. Make it right. Give me a chub. <laughs> well, right. just make sure you're going. We've got two. One motion. You can't be throwing right hooks in that thing. We got two questions left. It's tight ball game. It is. We, we have got only two left. Chuck two and Ryan left. are tied. I'm behind by half a point. What do you guys ready? Yeah. yeah. What do paleontologists study? Oh, was right. the last. Was first. Paleontology is one of my favorite things. Two, um, three, bones in the dirt. Four. Be mm. more specific. No, that was his answer. Fossils. Yeah, I'll give it to him. Yeah. Bones in the dirt. Uh, God damn. That was real Sorry, loose. Marcia. That, that was. That was sloppy. <laughs> that was a slop. That Jurassic was a Park. Sloppy answer. <laughs> uh, well, I don't know how specific or, or vague to be. That was very vague. All right. I was. This one. Can I get the pin real quick? How much so is the yeah, last one worth? Um. What are we going to have a lightning oh. round? Uh, no. Ryan has five. Chuck has four. I have three and a half. So this one is worth. Three points. Three points. Charlie has... F- when was the last question that Charlie answered right? It doesn't matter. Shh. I'm like keeping a score. point since... Hey. I re- he had two in a row so recently. I just two in a row. When? Hey. What is that? Just say? recently. Yeah. yeah. Where, you Where have you been? The lead. Where have you been? I'm up and on fire. I'm You're like, winning. You're in the lead. Yeah. By yeah. one. I answered two in a row. They gave me the but lead. Yeah. You're below that. Chuck was in the lead. And he you was yeah, one too. behind me. Nope. At the start you, of this round. I think this might be a deduction, Lyle. Okay. You're not in charge of that. You don't say that. You're getting close, mister. All right. Just, think about this. I'm going to set this one up a little bit. Just so you know, Charlie. So think about... <laughs> mustache is answering the question. <laughs> <laughs> if you win, you don't get a free ejaculation. <laughs> Who wants so a free think about... Yeah, uh, the beholder. Okay, let me know when you guys are ready. Give ready. Me th- give Sorry. Me a thumbs up. Guys. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Okay, that means you're ready to listen, <laughs> ready to learn. Okay. Mount up. Ready to answer. Yeah. Okay, here you're we go. You're not used to having students so in person. I understand your lack of control here. No, actually, yeah. Yeah, it's I, I'm, new development he yeah. does have yeah. in person. I'm used to younger. Uh, More mature. Small, <laughs> smalls that want to learn and, and better their lives. Then th- this is a question God that'll help you. that. We're trying to worsen our lives. This person worked for me this summer. <laughs> That's hard to believe. All right. 
<laughs> so think of the world. There's four mm-hmm. hemispheres, right? Sure. Okay. How many? Four. Four so hemispheres. That was a good question is having to explain it. Yeah. Well, okay. I, I got to set this up a little oh, bit. Oh, it's a setup. I'm okay. thinking he's... Four on. hemispheres. Four hemispheres. Northern, eastern, western. <laughs> so no. think of the globe and you cut up into yep. four pieces. Yep. Gotcha. Okay. Which is the only continent... With land on all four hemispheres. Mm. Can't say my name. This is an audio platform. Right, dog. Thank you for acknowledging my <laughs> <laughs> continent. You said. Mm-hmm. And the stalling practice is going to get taken away here quick. Oh, Which boy. is the only continent with land in all four hemispheres? Five, four, Asia. three, eh. Antarctica. Think about where it's at. <laughs> I know. But that, that's a half point deduction. What? It wouldn't get the southern. Though. That's a good answer, though. Mm-hmm. Except for the south, I'm because, because it's you, you got to get to the north. But it's it's yeah. yeah. Oh, the north. Yeah. All right, Chuck. There's seven continents. They placed two. At least five left. Five. Four. Yeah, no stalling. Three, He's stalling. Two. Africa. This one I didn't. Oh, really? I, did, I didn't realize this I one. I thought North America would be the obvious choice, so. One, went. two, three, four. Okay. How's that? So did low. Did you think this question up? North Africa. <laughs> <laughs> North Africa. Okay, so you got Chuck a gets a half point for that one. <laughs> do, you have, <laughs> do you have a follow-up question for the final question? Since nope, no that's one, it. That's it? Oh, that was That's the conclusion. So, we, didn't, we didn't derail here. Well done, Lyle. That was great. Here we go. Yeah. So <laughs> the final tally is me with three, because I got deducted somehow. Being a dick. Uh, yep. Chuck. <laughs> <laughs> Chuck with four and a half. Oh, people don't forget Ryan. Mm-hmm. And good old Rye Dog with five. <laughs> five whole points, five and I a half. I think it rigged. Because I got robbed of my half point. I started off negative. If, if we decide to do this, I will bring a prize for the next time we do this. Yeah, okay. I'm going to hold you to it. Okay. This is good. I love it. I think we need to rotate. Well, it comes up with the questions, but no, I like it. The prize is... But I like train that. Wreck if it was but can I read else? the question? No, Absolutely. that wouldn't, that wouldn't work. Com- or maybe... No, yeah. No, I like it. Because then someone would know the answers. Yeah. The, the prize is really all of our viewers who got to see the side of our face looking at you this whole time. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can see it. I had fun with that. Yeah. No, well, I'm I glad you I used a better ink choice this time. Yeah, I did. Yeah. That was really well thought out. And not, we truly do learn from our mistakes. Yes, yeah. we do. Good job. And that is Are you the, about to say something? And that's the best way to learn is that we make a mistake and correct it. Yeah. Yeah. By that, and you guys learn that with behavior, by behavior that modification, logic, and yeah. you should really be ahead of the game. Ooh. Yep. Did someone, did someone cut one? No, I bumped. So getting like a hot dog you smell. Hmm. Uh. Putting a lot of weird stuff in weed these days. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's true. <laughs> I'm not <laughs> leaking from under. It's from under cheese. I'm not leaking anything. But do you get a whiff of that? Maybe it is pot. Yeah, it's probably. It's pot. hard when we're all enclosed in here. Yeah. These charts have been through. So, Rye, where are we moving from this? Well, I can't see how much time we have left. Roy's neglecting to update me, but we're Eight at minutes. seven. Um, I'm thinking we are going to take a quick break. All right. I like it. Let's reconfigure our uh, our situation here, and we'll move on to the next segment. We'll wrap her up. Nice. And, well, I don't know if we're going to wrap it up, Roy. <laughs> <laughs> We, left. we might we'll, we'll move it on to the next segment okay, okay. <laughs> sounds good to me does that sound good <laughs> yeah whatever you want to do Ryan this wrap is it up <laughs> <laughs> I'm just a guest <laughs> a humble guest whoa what? there yeah. buddy yeah we're off come on in we're yeah we get busted drink we're not technically party well, we're back to the show. <laughs> Roy's still finding his seat. We're all shocked. We're about to leave. We found out. We've we found found missed the whole something. fucking page. <laughs> missed the whole page <laughs> of questions. Well, well, about one, two, three, four. So, one, two, three, we missed some four, good ones. Son of a bitch. Um, we are going to... I'm, I won round one. <laughs> 
I this think is the bonus we're... round. I think we got to start this as round two. No, because it's a continuation. So we're going to put a pin in that. So Ryan is not the winner. No. Nope. Check, check. I mean, so again, attitude. Well, I was, that's clarifying. Okay. That was a clarifying statement. Oh, okay, I don't sure. Want that and I'm just setting you where we're at. Sure. You're on, so. you're on the line, sir. Okay. So your actions have consequence. Are we that's giving so you consequence, Lyle? That's so true. Yeah. Okay. Are we deducting I'll, half? I'll, I'll mind. Not yet. Okay. Okay. Just a little warning. That's the second yeah. warning he's had. I know. I know. It's a new setup. It was a change of routine. You know, I think we could probably polish us off with a sipper. Well, uh, time will tell. Does yeah. everyone need a sipper? Let's see. <laughs> Charlie? <laughs> uh oh. All right. All right let's your, just knock this out. All right. Let's get your minds on geography. <laughs> What'd you say? Okay. What, JoJo? Okay, go ask mom, okay? She'll feed you. <laughs> chop, yeah. chop. Go inside. It's freezing. Go. Chop, chop. Go inside, please. It's freezing. I know, Mom will get you something. All right. Yeah, Amy, please. <laughs> All right. Think geography here. Yeah. Okay. Geography. 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 Geo, geo from the Latin, free, from my yard sailing experience. Okay. Get geo. Geo free. Go free. Which river flows north through the Grand Canyon? I can't think of it. Colorado. Dang it. Bing, bing. Drew a big blank there. Okay. That's the first question he's answered right in 45 minutes, and he just tied <laughs> me for the lead. Not true. No, he's actually ahead of you now. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. We were tied? <laughs> no, you weren't How tied. How could he have taken the lead? You were ahead by half a point. Oh, for fuck's sake. Now he's ahead by half a point. <laughs> just so you know, his mustache gets the award. If he beats He me. might get a half point for the mustache. Okay. We'll see. Uh, okay. We'll see. Let me know. I mean, I have a new hairstyle going on here. Mm, I think that's your normal hairstyle. <laughs> You've been growing that for 10 years. years. <laughs> Grow that fucker. <laughs> Actually, 40. Uh, August. <laughs> <laughs> How dare you, Charlie? All right. All right. Think about earthquake. Think about earthquakes. Why can't you just okay. read the question? What is the name for the area directly above an earthquake's focal point? A fault. And I've maintained he put his back down. Like he did. He I, I will grant that. He That's just yep. Yep. the epicenter. Bing, bing. Mm. Lead change. <laughs> okay, the last one. Oh, no, I got two Are left. Are you sure? That's what you said last <laughs> no, time. I got two left. <laughs> oh, shit. I got 17 more. <laughs> <laughs> got a whole other page back here. <laughs> so let's take a vote. There's three of you. Do you want a Game of Thrones question or a pop culture question? Pop, pop culture. Pop culture. All right, that's two of you. <laughs> I know nothing about Game of Thrones. Never watched it. Oh, shame. That might be a half point. Yeah. We'll think about it. Yeah, it depends. <sighs> Sorry, I'm not gay. <laughs> <laughs> the Red Wedding. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> Which band was originally called Starfish? Limp Biscuit, no. <laughs> Fish. No. Well, good, good choice. Drop the star. Mm-hmm. I got it. They talk Which to band Justin was originally like, called ri- was star. originally called Starfish? Canadian band. No, you can't answer twice. Ooh. Why would you give them an extra clue? The stash. <laughs> Rush. No. Oh, that'd be amazing if that was true. Canadian band. Russia's Canadian. I know. You should get minus a point. <laughs> Coldplay. Oh, really? I didn't know that. I thought you were. I thought they were I British. Thought... They're not Canadian. They're not Canadian. <laughs> yeah. They're Coldplay British. is not no, Did I say Canadian? Yes. Yes. <laughs> we, should all get a point. we should all get a point you for that. You all get a half cool. point for that. We're all the back of the bus. <laughs> God. And it's Give me the pen. off the rails. Just got derailed. All right, last one. Chuck, this is a Game of Thrones one. Sorry, buddy. Awesome. Well, it's really between you and Ryan. answer first. <laughs> Should we make this one for all the marbles? How many points? Uh, Chuck's kind of, yeah. It's, 
All right, here we go. What's the, how many points? I guess we're just going for it, Roy. Ten yeah. points. Ten points. Wow. Ten points. Okay, ten points. <clears throat> In the Game of Thrones, who is Joffrey Baratheon's biological father? The King's Hand. That's no. <laughs> Your mom. <laughs> One point. <laughs> what? That's not. In the Game of Thrones, who is Joffrey Baratheon's oh, biological father? Now. Think of season one. I got it now. Jamie Lannister. God damn it. Wow, I got there. <laughs> you wouldn't even know what's going on in here. <laughs> I can't imagine. Woo! It's a Ryan one. It's a landslide. Yeah, it was. Coming down. That was a good one. That made yeah. me think when I... God. But he was the king's hand. No, he wasn't. No. He was King's Guard. King's Guard. No, is so the hand were, was Is that who you were thinking of when you said Yeah. That? Oh, and then really? once I after I said that, I'm like, God damn, it was Jamie Lannister. Because it was Ned Stark was the hand that got executed. And then but before him was um you know, you should really watch that. We didn't know who the hand was mm. before Ned Stark, did we? Mm mm. We must have they, they made reference, him. but Oh, we never saw he him. He wasn't a character. Wasn't a character. Yeah. It's too bad they've completely... This is talking... We're talking about that. incest here. Yeah. That was oh, an yeah. incest. Uh, yeah. yeah. Sounds exactly what I want to fucking watch. <laughs> nah, it's pretty watchable. You actually get to see him uh, do no it, thanks. too. You do. Multiple times, I think. <laughs> no, thank you. And they almost kill a kid. It's all right. No, they Chuck. do kill a kid. No. Or almost... They cripple a kid. Yeah. It's yeah. Just a crippling. Yeah. yeah. Just a paraplegic. He's got a great body, Chuck. You'd love it. <laughs> she does, too. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. We'll only see her from the waist up. Yeah. No, and remember when she does the shame. walk of shit. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and then fun fact. Yeah, oh yeah. The nun, or wh- whatever she is. I think she's a nun, right? At that time. Yeah, she is uh, the boss lady for Ted Lasso. Yeah, you would never connect the dots on that. Nope. I just made that. No, you said that, yeah. And she's a good singer. Yeah, she's actually a classically mm-hmm. trained uh, opera singer, hand I believe. Hand dancer? Oh. Hand dancer. <laughs> <laughs> no hand dancing. Do you want to show me? No, we did that already. Good? Yep. So, what did we learn tonight, gentlemen? We're not very what's, smart. What's one thing? Let's start with. Let's start with Ryan. What did you learn tonight, Ryan? Charlie loves gin. <laughs> <laughs> Charlie loves gin. Yes. <laughs> yes. And a good old that hazelnut. Is f- that is a fact. Loves it. Chuck, what did you learn tonight? Uh there's no North Africa. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there's. There is North Africa, but it's not. It's just called Africa. North Africa's my favorite country. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> <sighs> Loy. I'm obviously not very good at trivia. What'd you come in? Last. <laughs> Her face. <laughs> By how far? Yeah. By how far, though? That was uh, a tie race. Yeah. Well, before you got the bonus I round. I was in the lead, and then... I, don't I lost I by don't know. a point and a half. It's not bad. No. Not bad. Not bad. I thought you did great. Yeah, I felt like I came in strong and then just lost it. I like the idea of someone else creating the questions. Hmm? What's that? I like someone else creating the questions. Oh. If you're up for it. Yeah. It's a lot of work. Yeah, I, mean, I do it, everything the Google... else for the podcast. I'd love to do that. <laughs> 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 or I can keep doing it. I love it. And I'll have a prize. I think this is your thing, Lyle. Oh, okay. Because it was a train wreck. Trivia train wreck. It was going real smooth until we took a break. And it was like, oh, there's a whole other page I forgot. It wasn't an epic train wreck, though, no. tonight. Not like the first time. Not off the... This was in true um, Lyle style that... And just the only way that it could have gone wrong, it, it did. It did, yeah. But it didn't go wrong. It just went a little different. A little sideways, yeah. I thought it was a hoot. What did you learn, Lyle? I'm not sure. You have a power hungry uh, problem. You're yeah, he does. No, I like I, I like you like, like when you're doing this. I, I, I like that power of like you disrespect me. Half point. Yeah. I like that. That's what called a power trip. I like that. <laughs> but no, he it's wants to look me in the eye. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Half point mm-hmm. deduction. Did you notice how I won mostly off of just my good behavior? Mm. After you got, I got you, slapped on the wrist. I mean, some favoritism and then I, on the non-deductions. We, I learned how to work with Lyle mm. in the summer. Yep, and you got a bonus point for the stash. Sure. Yeah. You did. Thank you. 
Kept you in the we game. All need, I mean, I know he's not going to shave his beard. No. I mean, you'd probably Ooh, be right. How many points would that? That would be a lot of you points. I know, I, know, I know Ryan would get rid I, of his goatee. I well, know you would, would get rid of yours. I yeah. contemplated it for about five seconds, then my wife went. You told your wife. Okay. So no, she read it. She was sitting right next to me. Three stashes in a beard. I was going to do it, actually. <laughs> I'm gonna. I've never actually grown all this. That I've long. done a stash. So when I'm, I was gonna in the just, I'm gonna just. I'm gonna go full. Mustache bar. March. Have You've been, been doing that all summer, though, isn't that a it, full summer's my, growth? Well, <laughs> that's yeah. like They're, couple. It's oh my god. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, yeah. coming in real nice, real thick. You could shave that, put it on the inside of a oh. flannel, and you mm. get mm. least the lining. <laughs> yeah, mm. keep you nice and warm at night. Mm-hmm. I got to do the beard though for the winter. You gotta do the stash, man. Yeah. Come I'll on. Do this stash. Look at what I'm. Look at. Look at this. Look at that face. Uh, yeah, you got an extra point for it, Chuck. I'm, Thank I'm you. Respecting that. Yeah. I told him he was you're asserting his dominance you're, you're, when I saw him. I'm still tasting this fabulous <laughs> Martinez. <laughs> Almost thirty minutes later. Thirty minutes later. Drink in my mouth. Really? First, first mm. time I met you, Chuck. It was Halloween. I didn't know anybody. And you come in dressed as Coach. Oh, oh yeah, something. 70s coach. That was awesome. And I'm just like my greatest, my greatest moment with you. I was like, yep, and you, that's awesome. You had the billy go. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you were in character all night. Yeah, that was awesome. That was hilarious. Was a um, we should bring that back. Along the lines of what we were just talking about, Roy is still tasting a chicken wing he ate four years ago. <laughs> Well, yeah. just, just saving it, yeah. Yeah, just pull it out when I'm a little hungry. <laughs> There's AIDS at the very end. Very tough. Yeah, just <laughs> from his clientele. Yeah. <laughs> Probably a little fentanyl down there, too. Yeah. yeah. Oh, let me sniff it. That probably smells. Screw it. You're not even allowed to touch it. Why do you think you could oh. sniff it? Well, we sniffed uh, Chuck's beard on the break. Mustache. Or his mustache, excuse yeah. me. Yep, smelled like fine wine. Mmm. Mm-hmm. All well, right, fun episode, you guys. It was yeah. a fun episode. Time. Yeah, I think we're going to. Oops, I think we're going to have to end the podcast. Yep, I think it's a good time to wrap it's it a good up. Good time. Um, so I am always a little mixed up on these buttons, but um, so thanks Jen. for listening, everybody. I am your champion. <laughs> I'll always be your champion, <laughs> and um, we'll see you next week. All right, have a good one. God bless. Ciao, ciao. Yeah. Right, that's all we have for you guys today. Thanks for joining us. Make sure to join our club on Facebook at Supper Club Social. Underneath this week's episode... Go and write a review of the drink if you've had it or if you decide to make it. And we will pick one or two of the comments and read them out on our next episode. You can find us at Apple Podcasts, Spotify, our website at www.supperclubsocial.net. We look forward to seeing you guys next week. Have a good one. Take it easy. Nice. I didn't know I had to do my part again. You got to do your part again.